CADMAKERS Virtual Construction is an integrated construction technology company. We started the company to solve a problem with getting multiple stakeholders, multiple technology platforms, 2D, 3D, to try to come in together in one place and identify constructability challenges ahead of live construction so that you can put in actionable plans and solve those problems prior to having people on site. The tool that we chose to use for that is the 3D Experience platform. The reason is we think there's a lot of best practices that can be leveraged from other industries that we could apply in a unique way to construction. The type of people we like to deal with are forward-thinking individuals that understand that old-school practices in AEC are slowly dying. We started using CAD makers a year to 18 months ago. Certainly what we're finding is that the earlier they get involved, the better coordinated our drawings are. We've since rolled their services onto a number of projects. In AEC, there's many different softwares being used. The challenge we find is to be able to best communicate and find the best workflow to leverage the power of the SoSystems suite of products, which we think are, are fantastic. As a partner, we look at things pretty holistically in our company. At the end of the day, we believe that Katia, 3D Experience Platform, is possibly the most powerful software out there. It comes down to how do we implement the technology in a way that really adds value. That's what we, we try to do both on as a customer of DISO Systems and as a partner. So where can we leverage this, the knowledge that we're getting on both sides to add a full kind of product and service that adds a lot of value for our customers. We have a, a unique way of selling to construction. From day one, we can do the work. We have engineers in-house that are able to use the technology. What we do is we allow construction companies to get the benefit of this technology, but not necessarily have to invest a large amount of money up front. By having an additional set of eyes and a different stream of coordination, what we're finding is by integrating CAD makers into the normal design process, everyone benefits. The first step is to help them own the data that we create. So we sell access to the platform and then we sell design review. And an OV design review will allow us to generate big 3D data to do the reviews, but then now other stakeholders can open the model. That's been the simplest way or the most cost-effective way to get access to the data that we're creating. And then over time, we can expand different roles and applications within the software. So our approach is very much a passive approach at first and then help expand that relationship into how our, our customers and clients can do this for themselves. The relationship between our virtual construction services and selling the cloud is of critical importance. So by being able to adopt the cloud with most of our projects, we're now being able to deliver our work every time in 3D and in 2D. We have some, some advantages over our typical workflow. The Aquatic Center is a project where we use the 3D Experience platform to coordinate drawings prior to construction. And what we found is that it identified a number of issues. With the additional time we've had, we've, we've been able to get an in front of a lot of problems that we otherwise normally wouldn't have seen until much later. The strategic element of 3D experience being purely platform and cloud-based, we believe definitively is a competitive advantage. It's truly a database where you can generate massive amounts of data and use tagging and searching to leverage that data. It's a differentiator. As far as the quality of the finished product, we certainly expect all of our projects to have a very high level of quality, but what we expect the 3D Experience platform to do for us is allow us to get to that same point but at a reduced cost ahead of schedule. In business, there's two ways of looking at things. You can solve the problem today, which is very good, but you always have to keep an eye on what's going to happen tomorrow. And if you look at Dassault Systems strategy right now, it's very much about understanding where we're going and less so about where we are today. Yeah.